Hey guys, today I want to show you how to import electronic bank statement into manager and we'll also assign some other transactions. So what we'll do is we'll click on bank account, select our bank account and then on the right hand side here you'll see that we've got import bank statement. If we click there at the bottom it shows which file types are supported. So on your electronic internet banking you'll export your statement in one of these formats. We'll click browse and then we'll point it in the direction of our electronic statement minus in QAF format. Here we'll click next. Here you'll see the number of transactions that it will be importing and I'll click import. Right, so now at the bottom, here you'll see all the transactions being imported from my electronic bank statement. Our top one is uh, bank charges. Second one is interest earned. These two transactions are assigned to the tracking company's invoice. Uh, this will be entertainment, this will be bank charges and another interest earned. So right here on top, you can see that it's got uncat uncategorized receipts. You can click view. Here we can do a bulk bulk update. So what we'll do is we'll create the two credit received. Select payee. It's the bank. And that will be <coughs> interest received. There we go. These two we can't really assign. So we'll have to go edit. Go to accounts receivable. And here we can select the invoice for the tracking company. And select this as a payment. And click update. Our second one will do the same. Select to the same company. Select accounts receivable. Select our invoice that we want to assign that amount to. And click update. For now, for interest sake, let's go to our sales invoices. You'll see the trucking company has got an outstanding invoice. This is the amount that's been paid and this is the amount still outstanding. Okay, let's go back to our bank account. Here you'll see that we've got bank charges and bank charges. So let's go check our uncategorized payments. This charge and this charge belongs to the bank, which will be bank fees. And we'll click update. This is now entertainment, so we'll do it separately. It's an expense, which will be entertainment. Payee will be employee. And update. And that's all our transactions.